It was a glamorous and artist occasion as friends, family, and well wishers gathered to celebrate Evangelist Dr. Fumi Aragbaye's 70th birthday and the remarkable milestone of over four decades of a divine call to gospel music ministry. The colorful event also featured the launch of a biography detailing her inspiring journey. Fumi Aragbaye, in her speech, expressed profound gratitude for God's faithfulness and grace in her life, witnessing her 78th birthday. I thank him for the grace to attain age 70. So all I have to say is just thank God to sing uh, songs of praise to God Almighty. Thanking to God for, for good health because it is when you are healthy that you can say you want to celebrate. I'm thanking him principally for good health, for good stature, for good, for everything, for everything in my life. The owner of Ilefe, Obainito Adeyeye Ogunwusi, commended Iragbaye's significant impact on the Christian ministry. <laughs> Marcos Aragbae, the celebrant son, spoke warmly about his mother's caring nature. She's, um, she's a very strong woman. She's, um, she's very tough, so I think one has to be tough to be able to achieve um, what they want, really. So, yeah. Former Governor of Valtry State, Issa Iguda, encouraged young people to emulate Aragbae's life of service and humility. You can imagine that somebody uh, is at 70, so it has to be a special event, and particularly for somebody who has served humanity, and of course he has, uh, he has uh, laid so many uh, indelible marks, and of all, a woman of God. Governor Loki Aida Tua of Undo State, represented by his special advisor on environment, Dr. Olayemi Adeyemi, praised her act by his contributions to humanity. The Lord should strengthen her the more, give her more long life and prosperity. The grace upon her should continue and impact more life positively. Other dignitaries in attendance also spoke highly of evangelist Dr. Fumi Aragbaye. Aragbaye is a well-known gospel music icon in this country. And she's popular beyond the country. She's known with her sonorous voice. And I can tell you that her music must have motivated the law people to be steadfast in the Lord. So we thank God for her life, for sparing her life to be 70. Being a faithful servant of God, she worked very hard, especially for her to be in leadership for two solid years, you know, for Goman. I pray that God Almighty will continue to uphold her, that even in her old age, she will bear more fruits in the name of Jesus. This is my wish for her. Giving gift to this generation, and uh, you can see in her life, despite that, she is a, a celebrity. She all who are saved. Very greatly that uh, I so much uh, appreciate her. In Highlights of the event included a cake cutting ceremony and entertainment of guests, where Vajaris Ebenezer Obi delighted everyone with melodious songs, adding to the festive atmosphere. Taiwo, Olari Impact TV News.